We've also got a great individual matchup here tonight. Tracy McGrady and Ray Allen, two of the top players in the NBA. In the last six games, those, ty those guys have played against each other. T-Mac has scored 38 points a game. Ray Allen only 23. So those guys are going to be going at it. All right, now when we talk about uh, Seattle, of course, you think about Ray Allen. He signed that big free agent contract in the offseason. Yeah, Ray Allen is, uh, is one of the great shooters in the NBA, but he has struggled so far this season. Only shooting 41% for the year. Still averaging 24, 24 points a game, but he's got to take a lot of shots to get those, to get those points up. But Ray is very, very smooth. He had 35 points in their last game with, with the boss in overtime to go in the state. He can give this Rockets uh, team the, the, the scoring and the spark they're going to need on the second night of the back to back. Yeah, Juwan played only 19 minutes last night. He never really got into the flow of the offense. Here's T-Mac. He's picked up on a double team, so they find Ryan Bowen. They run off and lead him, and Ryan hits. But offensively, he has really picked his game up. Rittenauer passes up to Allen. Allen hits the three at the buzzer. That's what you fear because do not protect that three-point line. They try to protect the middle, and there's that fall away. Ray's got that same fall away jump shot that Tracy McGrady has. They create a little contact to McGrady. He'll rise up from the parking lot. Tracy McGrady, that's all he had to do was move back to about 25 <laughs> feet. It just kills your defense when you play 24 seconds defense when you give up an offensive rebound. Well, you finally made one, Ray. You give Ray Allen all those opportunities, he's bound to hurt you. McCullough gets the offensive rebound. Fresh 24 for Houston. Brady won't use it. Boy, right in his rhythm. Three-pointer count. And yeah, there's a foul, but you know what? That, that jump shot by T-Mac was right in his rhythm, but he came down on his uh, on his leg and he rolled his, one of his ankles there. That jumper looked really smooth. Let's watch this. And now picks him up. Now he wants to leave him, but he can't. And T-Mac gets a nice pick from Yao Ming to tie the game at 42. Tracy with eight points. Ray Allen on the drive, puts it up with the left hand. He did go over the top of the glass. The rule now is if he doesn't touch anything, it's still in play. Allen, that was shot, and a foul is called on Houston. Once again, Luther Head fouls the jump shooter. That's his... Third. Third. Luther's got to stop doing that. Let's watch on the replay how. Tracy McGrady outside. And you get a pick from Juwan. Goes to the left side. He's fouled on the shot. Was he behind the line or not? I think he'll shoot two. Rodmanovich picks up his first foul of the game. Trying to do a little pick and roll. He's definitely inside the line. And there's the foul on the wrist. It's the reaction to the ball coming off that rim. Don't they listen to me, Bill? No, they don't, obviously. Allen took a little tour through the lane. Nobody picked him up. They flew by him, and that's an easy two. Well, that, uh, now when the Rockets get a defensive rebound, which has not been very often, they can run a fast break. Brady trying to tie it up, and he does. The running gun Rockets. Team I quoted in the paper today is saying he... That is a good question. I will pay attention to that and let you know. I thought you had an answer for me right away. McGrady now starting to warm up. Tracy McGrady with 14 points. McGrady gets a pick from Yao, and he's right on the money. Tracy McGrady is starting to warm up. Well, and Yao has been setting the pick on the pick and roll. Rockets get the lead, and the Sonics establish that three-point, and uh, another smooth move by Tracy McGrady. Draws the foul from Evans, <laughs> and he's going to get two free throws out of uh, him. T-Mac is so good at that move. Let's watch it again. Pick and roll with Juwan Howard. There's the oop. Popping to all over. Steal by McGrady. He's got Yao on the left wing. What's he going to do with it? McGrady behind the back to Yao. Slam, no oh. count. Traveling is called on McGrady. Well, it, it took Michael Smith a long time to figure out whether he was going to call traveling or not. Okay, let's count the steps here. Allen with a jumper from the outside, and he misses. Game tied at 69. Rodmanovich on T-Mac. T-Mac goes up and in. Wow. McGrady with 20. 
McGrady makes so many jump shots. Seattle Supersonics are worst in the, in the league in defense. On the outside, three-pointer. Ray Allen coming to the party. Neither team can get up very far on the other. McGrady gets a pick from the combo and hits another one from the outside. So now McGrady and Allen <laughs> are starting. There they go. They're starting to, to play. McGrady out front. Rockets up by a point. There's that high pick and roll again that the uh, Rockets have been so successful with. Racing to the basket, draws the foul. He'll shoot two. Well, you pick your poison, don't you? Let's watch it here now. Matumbo has already set the pick, and there's the foul on the arm of Tracy McGrady. But a lot of firepower. There's one. Ray Allen to the basket. It's blocked, but a foul called before the shot. Tracy McGrady has called for his second foul of the game, and Ray Allen will go to the line to shoot. Ray Allen just pops out, catches the ball, and he just takes it right to the hole. So each team with one to give. Allen gets a pick, fires it up. Oh, it went in. Wow. A shooter's roll for Ray Allen. Rockets all of a sudden now not able to score. Allen with a three. Got it. And Seattle has regained the lead. Oh, the Rockets worked so hard. Brady coming off the pin. He's fouled, and it almost went. He'll shoot two. That's the play they usually run for Wesley on the other side. Yep. He just can't seem to get a break. For the Rockets, the last four or five games have been very effective in that third quarter. Rockets need a basket here. T Mac tries to provide it. A three pointer. How big is that? 5 10 left to play in the game. Ray Allen. Good helping defense by Yao. Allen looks up one second left on the shot clock. Barely grazes the iron, gets it back for two. Allen knew that ball was short. He chased after it. Nobody put a body on it. They're down by three. McGrady will try to tie it, and he does. But if you get three, take it. <laughs> Is that, that, no, 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 yes. <laughs> the Rockets trying to hold on and win again tonight on the road. McGrady out high. Mismatch. Grady over to Swift and on the pass off he's fouled but both teams are in the penalty so T-Mac will get two free throws. Rodmanovich comes out on McGrady. And on the shot clock. Grady fakes a three. Nice pass to Yao Ming. He finger rolls it up and in. Three point Houston lead. Allen will have it. Grady picks him up. Ray Allen takes it to the middle, draws the foul. He'll get two free throws, and that's automatic. Ray Allen, 9 for 24 in this game, but he is, seems like he's taken every shot here in the fourth quarter. Ray Allen has missed his one free throw for the week. Yeah. Six seconds, down to five on the shot clock. Down to four, down to three. McGrady over Rodmanovich. He fills it up. Ho, 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 Tracy McGrady. On the perimeter now, look out for Allen, he'll try to counter. Ian Wesley, Ray Allen on the drive, Ray Allen arches it up, got the roll, Ray Allen. What a soft touch. Allen with 30 on this six-game road trip. L.A., here we come.